Okay, I'm making this video showing how to um, fix the flashlight in Splinter Cell Chaos Theory Versus and get it to work with X-Fire. The first thing you need to do is download 3D Analyze. I'll put the link in the description. And uh, then you need to find your um, Versus folder. It should be in Program Files, Ubisoft, well, unless you downloaded it with Steam, then it should be in uh, Program Files, Steam, and something, you probably know where it is. Um, now, um, if you have Windows 7 or Vista, or probably Vista, I don't really know what you do in Vista, um, just follow what I'm doing. If you have XP, go to tools um, and folder options make sure that this box is unchecked you can recheck it later if you want but for now just make sure it's unchecked and uh, you need to find these two files right here and just copy them to a safe place like the desktop or something and now rename these files here rename this one the exe one to dot bak and rename the ex one to exe and now you need to find the um, 3D Analyze and um, press select and find the new um, the new EXE that you just renamed from EX so um, this one here and make sure you have all of these boxes here checked now save a batch file um, you can just save it with all the other splinter cell stuff doesn't really matter what you name it um, now go back to to the versus folder and find the batch file let's say dot bat right click press edit and at the very end change dot exe to dot ex close save now move these two files here that you copied back uh, back inside here and uh, replace okay and now um, now it should work with X-Fire and the light should be working just launch it from the dot BAT so you can make a shortcut on your desktop or something if you want and just launch splinter the cell from there from, from now on Okay, so that's it. Should be working now.